a traditional fishing method with a history of more than a thousand years. Transcending time, Nagara River cormorant fishing has been passed down and preserved through the ages, always accompanied by a dialogue between people and nature. The Ishihama coast of Ibaraki Prefecture. Wild cormorants are captured here and sent to cormorant fishing masters. To accustom the birds to their new environment, the master trains the cormorants. Their daily lives are spent in close contact. Cormorant fishing is made possible through this daily connection. The cormorant masters of the Nagata River memorialize deceased cormorants every year. The deep bond between the masters and cormorants has an undeniable allure. Sweetfish live abundantly in the Nagata River. Cormorant fishing is one of the many methods of catching sweetfish practiced on the Nagata River. Sweetfish caught in Goryo Ukai, imperial cormorant fishing, are carefully sorted and sent to the imperial household. Sweetfish caught by the cormorants is highly prized for its freshness. Every July, a memorial service for sweetfish is held at Shinmei Shrine along the Nagara River. Through the event, people involved in cormorant fishing consider the value of the lives of sweetfish. The Nagara River brings blessings to its basin and is widely loved as a place of relaxation. Viewing cormorant fishing from a Japanese-style houseboat is a great way to enjoy nature. The river expresses itself differently day by day. Sometimes it's calm, and other times it bears its fangs. With fear and reverence for the river, they pray for safety. Indeed, the life of a cormorant fishing master can be said to flow side by side with the river. Cormorant fishing is a communion of humans and nature. Thanks to the support of many people, it has overcome countless untold hardships, passed down and preserved to this day. Ukai, Cormorant Fishing, a dialogue between people and nature. We can only hope that it will continue tomorrow, the next day, and for years, decades, and centuries to come.